One, two, three. Much better. Wow. You sounded late to me, but <laughs> how dare you? I'm well, it would sound late to you, Joel, years. if you're normally early, right? Mm. I'm just I'm so punctual as to be pre-punctual. Not, not quite my clap sync. Not my tempo. Not, not quite, quite, quite my, my tempo. Not my tempo. Not quite my tempo. This weekend. Have you seen Whiplash yet? This weekend. You haven't seen it yet? This weekend! What the f I saw J.K. Simmons at a pumpkin patch. I saw him at a Dodgers game. I nice saw him in Spider-Man and Oz. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Man, Oz. Uh, he tattooed a swastika on my butt and raped me. Uh, your first question this week comes from Carlos A. O. C. Are any of you guys ever truly offended by some of the comments you receive in the vomit pit that is YouTube comment <laughs> section, or are you used to it by now? Uh, we laugh it off. Uh, yeah, most most of the time we laugh it off. There are occasionally comments that will get under my skin, but I don't mean they make me mad. They make me sad. Mm. Like what kind um, of comment makes you sad? Uh, I, I mean, I've talked about them before previously, but sometimes they talk about how my penis is too big. Mm. I hate that. It's not too big. I, I mean, we. It's not too. Your, your penis is not too like, big, buddy. No, don't I mean, worry. It's like, uh, your penis is just small girth. enough. It's like a kosher sausage. It's yeah, enough. but it's so thick and strong. Yeah, tiny. it's really. It's, it's got a little tiny penis. It kind of looks like. <laughs> uh, it looks like my forearm. That's what Bruce's uh, penis looks like. Uh, penis. Uh, after a while, your once people call you fat, hey! dumb, and <laughs> gay, after so many times, I don't know. You just, you just become numb. So we don't. I mean, the personal insults, I don't care. I can't change the way I look. I'm sorry. I got a dumb face. I'll deal with it. The comments that make me the most mad uh -huh. are actually the comments on the no, where people are like, these guys don't know anything. Oh, yeah. I'm going to tell you why I also don't know anything. <laughs> Those are the ones who's just like, they're, they're the most frustrating, and I also love them the most. I would also like to see their gaming news shows. Welcome back to the... Yeah. The comments that bother me the most are the ones from... Because I assume that people that comment on YouTube, they just showed up. Said something mean and left, yeah, right? That's yeah. what I assume. Yeah. I don't think that's always the case. Yeah. It's the people who like seek us out in other mediums, like on Twitter or like on Reddit or something, and they send us a long, heartfelt message that's like, like, please don't don't make fun of my obscure African religion. Like it really offends me, and yeah. it's like. <laughs> Okay, but we'll make fun of everything else. That's yeah. okay with you? All the J.K. Simmons jokes? How do you think he feels? <laughs> He's a big fan, and he gets really upset. I yeah, he sent that. me messages. I, I don't like, like J.K. Simmons' comments. You didn't see his Golden Globes acceptance speech? He said, uh, thank you to Bruce, Joel, Adam, James, not Lawrence. I, which was weird that he said that, he right? Said Lawrence, Lawrence is his biggest fan. I know. Yeah. Hmm. Sad. <laughs> Next All question right. from okay. Crucify This. If you could play in a game from the perspective of the bad guy slash enemy, what would it be? Hmm. Joel. That's a pretty good question, huh? Credit credit goes to this person for putting a good question in there. I, I actually, so I'm, I'm going to hijack this one a little bit. Oh, great. Uh, this was in a game magazine years ago. I don't even know which one, but someone was pitching bad ideas for games, and one of them was you play as a boss in like, you know, like a PS2 era game, and your job is to sit in a room for four to six hours, yeah. waiting for waiting the for hero, the mm. biting your time, doing bench presses, waiting for him, <laughs> and then he kills you and the game's over. Oh, <laughs> man, that sucks. Um, <laughs> what is a game where the main villain is your own sense of madness, despair, and paranoia? And small penis? Let's back off the line. You play as like a... Um... Papers, please. I would play as uh, the uh, Comstock from Bioshock Infinite. I want to see what it's like from his perspective. He gets to have sex with women all the time. Mm. All it, it's a good the joke. time. Hey James, subtle joke. He gets to, and then he, and also he's a real person and he gets to uh, eat food, really good food. He's got a taint. But the idea is that you're stuck in a room. That's the joke. There's a bench cool. press though, right? I have to answer. I'm good. Next yeah. question. I'm gonna say the. Sure. The taco guy. It's the taco guy. It's the yeah. taco guy. If you were spool for a day, what would you do? Come into work on time. Oh! Snap. Burn! Boom! Notice, Boom. notice how he's. Oh, what do you have to say about that? Welcome back to the spool show. That wasn't British at all. That was like C3PO. So I'm reading the question. Today's question is, if you were a spool for a day, what would you do? If I was spool for the day, I would go home. Uh, it's slippery and smooth? Sometimes it's, it can be rough if there's rocks underneath of it, so you gotta make out, make sure that those aren't there. It's a, mm, uh, I can't! Uh, thanks for watching the show. See you guys next week. We're not gonna do one next week. But...
I want to attach a GoPro camera to his forehead without him knowing, so that when he goes about his day, we can just see like it's, him like, it's like those dogs when you leave. I was gonna say GoPro, it's what people do to their cats. Yeah, exactly. That's what <laughs> I want to do with Spool. Do you think? Do you cat. think that if a GoPro is attached to Spool's head? It would come back and the footage would be just as shaky as when you attach it to an animal. <laughs> it's, like, <laughs> it's like, what is he walking Running around? Eating out of dog bowls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's lowering into the floor. Uh, next question. Kittens are evil. Wants to know what's the biggest disappointment you felt as a gamer. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. I feel it every day because I don't have Half Life Three. Oh, what? No. That's not a disappointment if I'm, it doesn't exist. That's an extreme no, disappointment. Yeah, I want that game. Sim City. Look, the <sighs> most recent Sim City that came out. That was a pretty big disappointment. Complete and utter disaster. Hmm. Uh, here's the thing. I, we got Fallout Four, and I never thought Fallout Four was coming. Yeah. So now Half Life Three's got to come. You really never thought Fallout Four was yeah, coming? Yeah, that's ridiculous. I actually really didn't. I, I, I thought it was one of those mythical things that Bethesda just sort of put off and was like, never mind, we're not gonna do it. I, I got a good answer. Yeah. Uh, uh, I'm disappointed in all the new consoles. They all have quirks. Like, the Xbox is just broken. Like, things just don't work. The PS4 was kind of buggy. It's actually, PS4 is probably the best one out of them. My Wii U is just on plug because I don't even play it anymore. When you say they've got quirks, it makes them sound like an adorable girlfriend who plays the ukulele. In as order to. As opposed to, like, defects, which is, well, they both have that. The, the desert like journey I have to go through to go from the main interface to, like, my messages yeah. and the load times in between is horrendous. Mm. It worked fine on the 360, and for some reason the Xbox One is like, they are figuring it out for the first time. But now Xbox all games are uh, 1080p, 60 frames a second. Not all of them, Ooh. no, not at all. If the Xbox had done what it said it was right. gonna do when they announced it with all the, the, the bullshit online always and checking in and media bullshit, would yeah. you like it more? It honestly would probably be the exact same problem. Yeah, are, hold on, guys. There are a lot of really poor people in the world and we're complaining about how long it takes to get to our That's messages. the question. They're not watching this. Yeah, there's, how, they can't they're watch it on their They're trying to Xboxes. figure out how to get clean water. Yeah, and yeah. like, or or they're disappointed as a gamer is, okay. not enough pieces for checkerboard. What? Or in, whatever. In Russia? Um, or Latvia? Or Latvia? Or Latvia? People are watching, Estonia? watching us right now on their Chromebook. Their uh, laptop, every laptop for every kid. No. Do you know okay. about 10% right. well, audience maybe on console? This, this story is Hold being on. retold in a cave through paintings. <laughs> maybe, maybe my biggest gaming disappointment yeah. will be a little bit more relatable. Okay. Mm. Brutal Legend. Oh, that's 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 the a Tim Schafer game. That's a good. All right, next question. How do you feel about a brutal legend, next Ethiopia? Question. Okay. It ended Who too cares? soon. <laughs> next question. <laughs> next question comes from Shangbang twenty four six. Shag bag. Six, shag, yeah. shag bag. Uh, it's very small text. Okay. In my bag. Either way. And twenty four six zero one. That's probably some part of your phone number. Won't somebody tell me? Answer if you can. Won't somebody tell me what is the soul of a man? What is? The, are these lyrics to a song? I don't know. Is uh, this a maybe. Are those lyrics to it? Joel? I feel like you know all the songs. Joel knows this answer. Somebody tell me, answer if you can. Won't somebody tell me, what is the soul of a man? It's a Castlevania reference, isn't it? Not an answer, but. I think Lawrence got it. You got Joel to sing. Is it a Castlevania? Lawrence, get it? Lawrence, is this a Castlevania? That stupid pile of secrets bullshit that people are still referencing 20 years later. Is that what it is? Pilot. Is that what's happening right now? You can't have one original question. You got to throw it back to an internet meme. From won't years somebody ago. tell me? Answer if you can. can. Won't somebody tell me? What is this the soul of a man? Hey, 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 hey. I saw Ender's Game for the first time over the weekend. Yeah, what'd you think? Not bad. Next question from Big Nookie. <laughs> if Game of Thrones did a Q&A, what would they have? A Funhouse themed question of the world! Yes, they would! Yeah, they would. Uh, by the time you guys are seeing this, we're already celebrating the finale of That's Game right. of Thrones. That's wow. right. We've watched um, it. Yeah, we watched it. Do we yeah. want to? We do we want to pretend as if this is the future? We've already seen the yes, episode. Yes, we do. Yes, we okay. do. Joel, what were your thoughts on the final episode? Yeah, what did you think of the final episode, Joel? Uh, I th I was really surprised when the Terminator came and killed um, Master Chief. Master Chief. I was surprised by that too. in front of the small council. But oh, it wasn't man. that surprising because Daenerys has been in all the trailers. Good point. So they hinted at it in the point. trailers. When I saw Ving Rhames appear as his Mission Impossible 3 character yeah. and help out Tom Cruise. He had that Cruise little leather pork pie hat on. And wow. the White Walkers. Yeah, that was I crazy. never would have guessed that they were bad guys, but they were. They yeah. were. I can't believe they showed penetration. Uh, it's a first. Yeah, I guess. Dicks are usually flaccid. Yeah, that's true. That was a I throbbing like cock. I did like to see that, though. And it came off of a woman. That's a good shot. 
The dragon sex scene went on a little long. No, it didn't. I, thought, I didn't think so. I thought perfect, it was perfect dirty. Mm -hmm. I finished twice. Yeah, it took a it took a little bit. But I don't know, final score? I give it like nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Nine, nine out of ten. Out of ten. Out of ten. So solid nine. That's really good. Uh, James, are you um, with us? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go six. Six? Could have been stronger. Mm, come on. Well, Can't wait for next season. Hey, though. we got two more seasons left. That's it. I. I well, we should prep for next season. Yeah. Well, how do we do that? We should do like some Game of Thrones themes questions. That's that a, great a great idea. idea. Nine out of ten. Yeah. I, no, I don't think we're gonna do that. No. What? <laughs> All right. Sorry. Well, what do you suggest instead? Up town. Fuck you up. Up town. Fuck you up. Step one: uh, grow a beard at fourteen. <laughs> Easy. Okay. Shave every day at fourteen. Right. It doesn't matter if you don't have hair there or not. Just start shaving. Wait, okay. shave it? I thought you were supposed to grow don't it. Don't shave it. Well, by shaving it, it grows yeah, faster. You, you, yeah, exactly. That's a myth. It grows in thicker every time you yeah. shave. Don't shave it to grow faster. Here's okay. the catch with step one, though. You gotta shave your entire body. The whole body. I don't see how shaving yourself gets It grows in thicker, James. That's, that's not, the way that's hair a myth. works. That's a myth. That's an urban legend. That is not an urban legend. That's what happened to me when I shaved my whole it's body. It's my Nashandigestein.